do this video. Uh, like the title says, Racism in Peru. Now, you might be wondering, Jamo, why are you talking about this? Uh, the reason why, to be honest, is because somebody asked me uh, on my old, old video about living in Peru. They were concerned. Uh, this, he said they're going, he, he is, his name is Rishi Ferrari, so what's a shout out, what's up? Thank you for uh, commenting. Anybody else, please feel free to comment. <laughs> he he just said that he's going to Peru in December and that he feels worried. He's heard things about racism in Peru that they don't allow people in. Sometimes restaurants or discotecas. So to that's today, that's what I'm going to be uh, talking about and discussing. So without a further ado, let's jump into it. Now, the first thing I have to say is uh, my experience is the timeline is basically three months. I was in Peru for three months, um, and it was it was a great it was a great three months for me, and um, and I was the place the location I was in. I was in Pimentel and Chiclayo, so that's in the that's in the northern part, like the northern coast of uh, of Peru. So that's kind of the, that's the area I was in. And to answer that question, is there is is there racism in Peru? I from from my experience, I would have to say no. Uh, no, I, I didn't experience anything. Uh, I had a great time there. Like I said, uh, when I went to you know restaurants with uh, the group of people that I was with, uh, I never experienced it. Sometimes we go to fancy restaurants and I never experienced a bad look or people kind of you know say are asking me you know you know kind of weird questions or anything like that. No, and when I went to discotecas, you know I paid my cash and I got in. You know, <laughs> so uh, so that was really it. So no, I didn't really experience anything. Now. You always have to be on guard, and maybe, like I said, you know, my experience is in the northern part of Peru. So maybe in the southern part of Peru, uh, maybe it's different. Maybe somebody, maybe I would have experienced something different. So you know, that's just how I am. Because you know, it's true. Because even in the United States, um, you know, there's different levels. Obviously, in the United States is a good example because there's racism everywhere in the United States. But obviously, the southern part, you know, the the Sun Belt, what is it called, the Christian Belt? I don't know. Uh, you know, Georgia, Alabama, racism manifests itself much stronger, I think, than in some other parts. You know, but so that's so maybe in Peru it's like that. Maybe in the southern part, it's more there's there's more racism and more manifestations of that. But for for me and my personal experience, you know, I had a great time. I didn't experience any problems with racism or anything like that. And you know, and also, I mean, a lot of the Peruvian people, you know, they're not, you know, they don't have the same features. And you know, like I do, but a lot of them are brown or even darker skin, you know, than me sometimes. Now, they, now with the hair, you know, if you're black and you're trying to get a haircut, you know, for me, my experience, I was there for three months and I just went without a haircut because I, I don't know, because a lot of them have straight hair, a lot of the Peruvians have straight hair, so I was, I was a bit tentative, I was, I was a bit hesitant to, you know, try to get a haircut there. So that you have to work out yourself. But other than that, I had a great experience. Um, I would definitely recommend uh, going there. You don't, don't. I would say, don't worry about racism. Obviously, uh, you know, racism and, and that and that spirit is is everywhere in in the world. So you may encounter it at some places, but it's not something to be specifically worried about. I mean, but Peru, just in general, if you're thinking about going, please go. You know what I'm saying? Uh, great food. You know, the ceviche is just to die for. You know, great culture, great history. So I would say, def don't let. Um, what maybe some people have said of their experience uh, hamper your desire to go and uh, but yeah but anyways if you do have uh, any comments or if maybe you've experienced racism or you want to talk about how great Peru is please comment below and uh, if you have any questions please ask uh, in the comment section and thank you so much for watching my video and uh, have a good day